So my racist ass neighborhood apparently say <clears throat> I'm selling fucking drugs and that my company is selling drugs. <laughs> like, what the fuck? So you can't be a nigga and live in a nice neighborhood where you're selling drugs and your company is selling drugs. And apparently, apparently I can't go outside. What's up, fans? Welcome back to the channel and shout out to the notification gang, gang, gang. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys subscribe because this is what we do and we do it daily. So hit that sub button, guys. So your boy X, he's a little scared of the police right now. And I don't blame the guy, man. There's been some spooky stuff that's going on. We all know there's good cops and bad cops, but I've been seeing some spooky situations out there, man. I've seen mothers call the cops to their house because they hear some some bumping in the night going on outside the house and the police shows up and mows down the caller and i just shake my head at those situations although they happen very rarely it's like god dang i wish they wouldn't happen right so we all know that x said he was going to take a break and he wasn't going to be so visible and i'm not gonna lie man he's he's done a good job of that i kind of miss the guy man i miss the drama so he posted something on his Snapchat, I would say about maybe a few days ago, and I'm now just getting time to cover this. And he spoke about him having problems with the police department. And he's like in fear for his life. And this is what he said. The Coconut Creek Police Department have been harassing me at my home. I'm letting the public know just in case anything happens to me. My assistant went outside to take a call and two police officers pulled up to my house almost immediately questioning her and saying allegedly my neighbors called saying a woman was crying so they were responding to that call mind you she wasn't outside crying just on her phone with a friend as soon as i came out and asked if there was a problem they left like god damn i mean this is like some this is like some get out type stuff now i don't know the races of these cops and that doesn't matter at all but the way he's telling this story, man, this whole situation seems pretty spooky. Here's the thing, man. When you're a rapper, a lot of these cops, they think you're up to no good. And I mean, they somewhat have reasons to believe that, right? In your music, you're talking about killing somebody. You're talking about doing drugs. You're talking about packing guns. I mean, you're pretty much snitching on yourself. So a lot of these police, they watch these rappers very closely. And that could be what's going on right now. They probably think some some dirty stuff is going on at the house, but but X is one of those people. He is very paranoid of the government. He is very paranoid of the police department, and I hope he doesn't do anything crazy and get himself shot, man. It's just simple as that. Stay away from the police. Anyway, you guys let me know what you think about this in the comment section below, and we haven't seen X too much lately, man. He's been off the grid. Hopefully, he's focused on making good music. Anyway, I'm Domin's Live, and you guys have a great day. I'm out.